Good afternoon. Thank you so much for this award for supporting the Feed the Future initiative. Mrs. Lowe and I have worked together on this initiative since its early days. We both agree that when it comes to foreign aid, we must ensure that our investments are not only helping solve the immediate problem, but they're creating long-term results. That's exactly what Feed the Future does. And that's why I was so proud to join my colleagues, both Republicans and Democrats, in supporting it. When I first became chair of the State Foreign Operations Subcommittee, I led a delegation to Central and South America. It was in Guatemala that we were able to see a Feed the Future project firsthand. This was a partnership between USAID and Walmart that connected small rural farmers with supply chains allowing those farmers to earn more for their produce. We saw how their training enhanced the quality in production, and because of that, their household incomes rose. It was well thought out and changed the lives of so many people in a meaningful way. I also want to congratulate an outstanding institution in my home state, Texas A&M University, for the important work they're being recognized for today. The initiative could not have achieved so much without the world's best experts from American universities. It's an honor to be associated with this vital program and to receive this award today. Thank you for that, all that you do to make our world a better place.